Because I've got a lot of uh, uh, junk in my trunk, honey. Do you know what I mean? Uh, I mean, what do you expect? Well, actually, I expect a decent amount. Oh! Probably could have gotten better PJs at Kmart. Such a beautiful dress. I love that it comes up to the neck. What is up, Vic Gang? Welcome back to another try on haul it's been a little bit since i've done one of these the last time i did it was at my my old house you better buckle up guys this one's a big one very much a spring slash summer try on haul but before i do begin i just want to give a massive shout out to jen street boutique for this beautiful piece i've got a discount code for any orders that are over 60 dollars you can get 15% off with Victoria 15, so you can head over to their Instagram and head over to their website to have a look and have a geese at all of their beautiful pieces. But today, I am doing a sheen try on haul, guys. A plus size, because I obviously am a plus size woman. Please do feel free to let me know which ones you do like on me, which ones I should keep. I'm feeling like I'll probably keep maybe two or three of them, but the rest are going back. This one is the first one. It's these cargo kind of uh, pants. So it's got an elastic leg, uh, ankle. It gives it that little, you know, little skinny ankle look. Uh, this is a 4XL. It's got pockets on the side here. The next one, guys, I'm trying to rush through these because it's getting dark. I started this and it was light and now it's getting dark. This is the next one. I love this dress. I don't think I'll keep it just because it's just a little too short for me. It goes above my knees, um, but I love the color. Like this color is everything. And like I said, again, with the elastic wrists, which is nice and cute. I'll show you what I mean. It's like a little peplum look. I believe that's in a 3XL. It goes all the way up to your neck as well, which I, I really like. This is the next one. It is a bit short. Not sure if I can turn around. It's such a beautiful dress. I love that it comes up to the neck and that the arms are elastic. It just gives it that little bit more classy look, I feel. Just come a little bit closer. This next one I'll probably have to keep because I've worn it and I've done a mukbang in it. Obviously I don't want to do that. I don't want to wear it and then give it back. That's just not right. So this one's in a 3XL as well. Um, and it's a long dress, guys. I love that it goes around the bust because if you're a big girl, you know that like you're, we hold a lot of chunk around our tummy area. So a lot of the dresses, they always put the seam like midway and it just looks so wrong. You've got that junk in the bonnet and then you've got junk in the trunk. So it just looks really weird in my opinion, but I like that it comes under the bust. But this is what we're working with. It goes all the way down to my feet. It's very beautiful, very long. I love the color, very much spring vibe. This next one I did not really like. It's one of the ones that are definitely going back, but it's a two piece PJ set. I don't like the pants. I mean, I did get the larger size I could find, but I have really big hips. Like you don't even know. This one's in a size 4XL. Uh, I, d I didn't mind the top. I probably should have gotten the shorts because they might have been more comfy for a big girl. It feels very cheap. It looks cheap. Uh, I mean, what do you expect? Well, actually, I expect a decent amount. Oh! I probably could have gotten better PJs at Kmart for the price of this. But anyways. But these are the PJs. I don't know how I feel. I've got really chunky thighs. I probably should have opted for the shorts because they do have shorts in, um, for these ones. This is what we're working with. I don't think I would feel comfy in these, sleeping in these. 
They do feel a little bit restrictive. This next one I didn't mind, but it is just a little too short for my liking. Like I said, it's it gives very much those beach vibes, something that goes over your swimmers. It's very cutey cute. I probably could have gone down a size in this one, but again, the, the seam is very much up the top where your bust is. When I look at this dress, I think very much country, like country, beach, south coast. Beautiful color as well. I like the material. It's very light. So there's that. It is very short. It is quite big. I don't know if that's the style. I could have probably gone a size down maybe. The thing with me is that it is a little bit short. I'm not a big fan of my knees, although I'm, you know, I'm very happy to have them. Uh, but the, the look of them, see what I mean? Big girl things, big girl things, Aria. It's not bad, I mean. So this next one is the bodysuit. Now, um, I have had bodysuits before from Boohoo. The only problem is that with the Boohoo ones, the, the higher size you go up, it just goes wider, but it doesn't go longer. And that was really my struggle because I've got a lot of uh, a junk in my trunk, honey. And so I needed that stretch like, do you know what I mean? Like it needs to go over. Like I really couldn't, I couldn't button up the ones from Boohoo by myself. So if you're a plus size girl, you have that issue. Go with Sheen. I got a size, um, I don't know what size this is, but it's on the screen, I'm sure. If I forget to tell you the size, I will make sure that I put it on the screen. This I can button up myself. It doesn't come undone. It's a very nice look. I love how it sits over my chest area. And I love this one. This one's definitely a keeper. This next one I have is quite nice. It's a nice summery dress. Uh, it's very long, so keep that in mind. I did get this one in a 3XL, but I probably could have gotten away with a 2XL. So it's very, very long, as I said. One of the things I like about it is the pattern. The pattern is very beautiful. The only problem is, is that the, um, the material is not like what you think it would look like. Or maybe it is, I'm not sure what you're what you're thinking. I like that it covers your arms. Like, I'm a big girl. One of the biggest things that I hate showing are my arms. I'm very insecure about my arms. So the fact that all of these dresses, I think, are good with the arms is a lot. This whole um, flare, I guess, wraps around. The material in it, I'm not a really a big fan of. It sort of has like a mix between like that dressy material and a raincoat. Like it very much sounds like it when you move. It will probably also help to get one of those things where you pull your dress through and make it go up just to give it a better look, for lack of a better word. You know, like a different kind of style because it just looks really bland when you wear it like this. This next dress is a nice one. Again, I probably could have gotten away with a smaller size. Like most things, it looks much nicer in photo than the quality, which is nothing wrong with the quality. I mean, you pay for what you get. Uh, this one, it was in a size 4XL, so I guess that's why. Um, it was a bit big, I could have gotten a 3XL. But this is it here. It goes all the way down to the ankles. The pattern is very, very pretty. But then again, like I said, the material is very, very thin. Like, I can see, I can literally see you through this material. You get what you pay for, guys. You could still get away with wearing this to, like, a birthday party or a nice dinner. There's nothing wrong with it. So far, I am loving the Sheen experience. next one I have no idea why I bought this this one is certainly going back um, so it's like a overall kind of thing but the pants are very very flary and airy they're very comfortable um, this is 
this whole gown, like this whole piece is very comfy. I can literally see, so you see what I mean? You can see my face through it. That's the kind of material that this is. It's very airy. It's very hard to put on. I don't know if I, like, it, it fit perfectly. I just couldn't get the back zip up just because it's like one of those things where it's like really hard to manoeuvre. It's like a cheap kind of zip, so I'm not sure how you would go with that. You could work with a singlet, although I am not confident to do that. I just did it for the purpose of this video. It's very much a, a costume that you could wear for like a church item, you know, like local kamiki, that kind of thing. You could get away with that. I mean, if it's your style, that's just, that's up to you. There's nothing wrong with it. I do like it, but it's going back. It's such a shame. I was so looking forward to wearing this. I definitely got a size too small. Of course, this is 2XL. I don't know why. I pictured this to be like a very stretchy material, which is why I got the 2XL. It fits like around my, my body and my waist. It's just my arms. Like my arms don't go in, um, which is annoying because I would have really liked to have worn this. Like, I like the patterns, if you can see, it's like a cottony... Do you see what I mean? It's got like the, that pretty pattern. You could wear it like a white singlet underneath or a black singlet. It's a nice work top, I think. It just adds that it fit your girl. Because she got a, a size too small. She got overconfident. She thought she was a 2XL instead of a 3 or 4XL. This next one, I'm tossing up whether I should return this one. I loved the look. I did. I really did. But um, I don't know if I'd be confident enough to wear this out. I guess if I lose a little bit more around my belly area, it could really work. But this dress, oh, it's so beautiful. I love that it goes tight around like just where your thigh area is. And then this flares. It is so beautiful, guys. Honestly, the other favorite feature of it is that it has... Like traditionally you have buttons down the middle, but this one has it on the side, which is really nice. It's a 3XL and I thought this one was a perfect size, perfect fit. So there's that one. You could wear it to a funeral. You could wear it to a birthday. This is the next one, guys. I actually really like this one. It is very fitting. This next dress is a nice one, although I don't think I'll be keeping it. It gives very much, you know, expensive dinner vibes. When I look at this, it reminds me of the Grace Bros, the Grace Brothers logo. If I don't know if you guys know Grace Brothers, although I think Grace Brothers is in America. It's not in Australia anymore. Well, not in Canberra. I don't know about um, anywhere else. But this is it. It goes just above my ankles, like calf muscles. It's got like a, a hard bit here, like a piece of metal in here, I guess, to for your cleavage. I do love that the, the flare goes all around the arms again. That's one of my favorite things. I don't like showing my arms. It does also have like a sticky rubber bit so that it doesn't slide off from your skin or your back. And this one I got in a size 4XL. So I could have gone down a size, although it would have really been fitting on my body. If I were to put it all the way down, it could probably definitely go past my knees if it was all the way down. But this next one was nice. I mean, I didn't mind this one at all. This. I like that it's got the cups in there. Like, it's already got cups in there, so it can hold your, um, your tootsies up. 
it's a size 3XL. 3XL, this is very durable, like it holds it very strong. You can adjust it, it's got adjustable straps, so you can adjust it. Uh, again, I like that the flary bit goes all around the back, so it covers your arms. The last thing you want is your arms flipping and flapping around while you're swimming. The last feature I like is that it crisscrosses around your chest. So it's very tight and it does feel secure. Okay guys, so this next one, I'm not sure if you can see the full extent of it just cause it is a bikini kind of thing and I'm not sure if I want to show my thighs. I am wearing a bra just because I can't be bothered taking it off because I've still got some more things to try on, but you probably, yeah, it, you probably don't need to. There is padding in there to support. Strings up here are pretty tight. Um, it's looking pretty good. The thing I like about it is that it does cover the arms, which is big girl friendly. It, it's ruched around here. It's got some stitching around here to give it that effect around your belly area. But yeah, I like that it's crisscrossed at the front. And girls, it's big girl approved, y'all. Get your swimmers now, or sometime. Second last one is this dress, this beautiful dress. I did like it, although you could probably get away with looking like a flight attendant. A lovely dress to wear out to dinner with your girls or to lunch, to breakfast. Or well, you could even wear it to work. It's got that corporate look, but it also, because of its shortness, it gives off a casual vibe as well. I do love the neck thing. I love anything that goes above my chest and up to my neck just because it makes that, it gives you like a slim kind of look. This one is a size 3XL. There's a variation in colors you can select from. I thought the maroon color was suitable for me, but I feel like that one's gonna go back as well. This is the next one. It is one of the shorter ones. I'm okay with the size at the moment. I don't feel too, you know, exposed. I love that it's got a long stringy neck. And the last one guys, the lucky last one is this two piece. This one is going back. I don't know how I feel about this one. You guys can tell me. I just felt like the skirt was a little too long. I love the pattern. I got this one in a size 3XL. So most of them I got in a 3XL. There were a couple 4XLs and there was one 2XL which was clearly too small. So I'll remember that for next time. This is the top. I don't know who I thought I was getting this. This gives very much Mexico vibes or like Bahamas, the island. You could go to Samoa, but I don't know if you could wear it there because you know, everyone's. So this is the skirt. It is a bit long. I think they could have gone shorter with the skirt. Uh, I don't, yeah, I don't know why it was so long, but I like that it sits above the waist. I like the top, it's just a bit too short for my liking. Okay guys, so that concludes my haul, my try on haul from Sheen. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. By all means, if you want me to buy something and try it on first before you make that purchase, then definitely comment it down below, but I'll be doing more of these try on hauls because I actually enjoy them. The more I do try on hauls, the more I feel like it, it's motivating for me because I think, well, I can't eat too much, you know, like I've got to stick to my routine, to my goal, because when those clothes come, I don't want to be looking, you know, any type of way. I actually want to look good. So it's basically, when you eat good, you feel good. When you feel good, you look good. And those three things are so evident when I'm on my journey. Like, I feel my best when I'm eating good. When I'm eating the right foods, when I'm fueling my body, my body is happy and I feel happy because I'm losing weight. I just feel good, like mentally, physically, emotionally, everything just sort of goes into order. And that's why I love this kind of me when I'm like, when I'm looking after myself. 
this is the kind of me that I really do enjoy. That's it for now, Vic Gang. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you haven't already, click that subscribe button, turn on the bell notification, comment down below your favorite outfit, which one I should keep, and share it with your family and friends and your girlfriends. Plus size Samoan girl trying on these clothes to see if you like it and you can get it too if you do. I'll see you guys in the next one, Vic Gang. My battery is about to die. Peace.